to subtract algebraic fractions, we need to have the same denominator. So let's check our denominators. We have b plus 1 and we have 1 minus b squared. We can rewrite 1, that is 1 to second power, so we will have difference of two perfect squares in the second denominator. So let me copy first algebraic fraction. plus 1 and now we will have 1 to second minus b to second power in the denominator and numerator we have to copy so now we will use formula that a square minus b square versus equal a minus b times b a of course plus b so first fraction we will copy b versus b and minus now numerator is 5 b plus 1 over and now we will have 1 minus b times 1 plus b in our example, a is equal 1, b is equal b. And now we see that we have here b plus 1 and here is 1 plus b. So I can change, I can put first the variable. So we will have 3 minus 2b over b plus 1 minus 5b plus 1 and we have 1 minus b and now I will put first variable plus the number we see that we have in the denominator b plus 1 and b plus 1 so the, this kind of denominator will have b plus 1 because we have to have expression which is divisible by the first denominator and by the second denominator so we need b plus 1 and in the second expression we have 1 minus b, so we have to multiply this denominator by 1 minus b to have the same denominator. So if I multiply this denominator by 1 minus b, I have to do the same with the numerator. So I have to multiply by y minus b. And the second denominator we have 1 minus b 1 minus b and b plus 1 b plus 1 so it's the same denominator so we can, don't have to do anything with the second algebraic fraction so now we have to do multiplication in the numerator 3 minus 2b we have to multiply times 1 minus b so 3 times 1 is 3 3 times negative b is negative 3 b negative 2b times 1 is negative 2b negative 2b times negative b is positive 2b square and we have minus the second fraction we will copy like i said and because we have first b plus 1 in the first denominator, so i put b plus 1 and next 1 minus b so this is equal now when we have the same denominators we can copy the denominator and we can combine the like terms and subtract so it will be 3 3b minus 2b is negative 5b and we have plus 2b square and we have minus before this whole fraction so we have to put numerator in parentheses b and we have mine 5b plus 1 in parentheses so this is equal the numerator we will copy and now 3 minus 5b plus 2 b square we have the, here is like invisible one negative 1 times 5 b, b is negative 
5b, negative 1 times positive 1 is negative 1. Now we have to combine the like terms. The numerator we will copy. And first I will put the highest power, so this is 2b to second, negative 5b and negative 5b, so this is negative 10b, and we have 3 and negative 1, so this is plus 2. In the numerator, we can factorize 2, so it will be b minus of course b squared minus 5b plus 1 over b plus 1 times 1 minus b. So this is my solution.